Now to one of our top stories all day long on ClickToHouston.com. A former minister out on bond after being accused of stealing more than $800,000 from Houston's First Baptist Church. Our Brittany Jeffers is joining us live outside the jail downtown where the ex-minister was released in the past couple of hours. Brittany? Yeah, uh, we watched as he bonded out of jail. He walked down the street. He didn't want to answer any of our questions, but the district attorney's office says that he is accused of stealing hundreds of thousands of dollars from the church where he worked. And the big question tonight is why? ignoring the cameras and questions. This former minister, Jarrell Altick, was booked earlier today, accused of stealing more than $800,000 from Houston's First Baptist Church and spending the cash on his lifestyle. The DA's office says this includes travel and a doctorate degree. He obviously was leading a lifestyle above his means at, at the time. It was just a, a large abuse of trust. According to Houston's First Baptist Church, they became aware of the suspicious financial activity in November of 2017. A statement going on to say, we have learned through the investigation process that acting alone, Jarrell engaged in multiple deceptive and difficult to detect techniques to carry out this theft. The district attorney's office says the alleged embezzlement happened over a six year period. Yesterday, Altic was indicted by the Harris County Grand Jury on first degree felony theft. Uh, it is terrible when people we look up to uh, fall short. Altic didn't have a comment for the cameras in the court room or on the street, but his attorney, James Alston, says that Altic aims to pay back all of the money. He's admitted fully to the to the offense. Uh, he's working with the church. He's trying to make amends for everything that he possibly can. Altic is due back in court on January 23rd. Live here in downtown Houston, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News. Thank you, Brittany. Right now on ClickToHouston.com, we have more video of the former minister in court, as well as the full statement from Houston's First Baptist Church regarding this case.